this is the basement of my Lego Simpsons house. I'm going to just go over each section. The different sections of the house can be stacked together. Um, and here's the exploded view, just because I'm not going to show brick by brick how to put it together. The save file is down in the description, and you can download the LEGO Digital Designer from the LEGO website. It's a free program. And so if you want to look at this piece by piece, you can download the save file. Here is the yard. Um, underneath, there's all this kind of scaffolding, which is just kind of to hold up the yard. I suppose if this were an actual Lego set you'd buy, maybe it would come with a box that you could actually put the basement into and have the yard supported up on top of it. But ultimately, I suppose you'd just remove the basement if it was a real Lego set, just to make things simpler. And the yard just sits nicely right around the basement. And then uh, we've got some pictures of the backyard. Here's uh, the garage, and here's the first floor. The, uh, the basement stairs you see I put in right next to the rumpus room. There are a couple episodes that suggest that the basement stairs are behind that doorway in the back hall. But if you absolutely have to have the basement coming in through the closet, well, I made a little Lego style secret hatchway in the front hall closet. So it is a basement entrance. It's not a stairway, it's a little ladder. But that way you can have it both ways. That's the regular stairway. And the rumpus room. There's the kitchen. And the, the TV room, living room. The other living room. And the dining room. And there's the little hatchway in the closet. And um, here's the second floor. I don't have any paintings on the walls or, you know, family photos or anything. That stuff would be done with stickers and such. Decals. And, of course, there's some things that are just too small for me to put in in Lego detail. So, this is the front stairs up to the second floor. That's Maggie's room. And that's the main bathroom. And Lisa's room with Snowball 2, and Bart's room, and the master bedroom, and the master bathroom. Then here's the roof. The, uh, it is built in a way that you can remove a panel of the roof off of either side. Um, 
You can't really do it in the digital designer thing. But I did make sure to make a section just fall into place. And this is the only bit of the attic I actually put in. This little Homer's weed smoking hangout area. And that's the whole house all put together. And um, I feel it's pretty accurate and it's at least more accurate than the Simpsons Lego house that was actually you know made by Lego that you can buy in the stores and you know someone told me that they didn't think I could do a more accurate version of the Simpsons house so here it is a much more accurate version of the Simpsons house I was never planning on making one out of Legos, but once I found out there was this Lego digital designer, I was like, well, here we go, I can actually give it a shot. And there it is. Enjoy.